Hey guys, what's up? I just got home from school and I thought I would make the response to last week's video in which I asked you guys to send me um, questions and I was going to pick some of my favorites and answer in the next video. You guys sent me your questions. I don't know why, but you guys all sent them on Twitter. And either way, I got them and I picked my favorites and in no order, this is just the order that they randomly got put in. I'm going to answer them. First question is from Nojo101 on Twitter, and she asks, if you could meet anyone in the world, who would it be? When I looked at this, I gave it some thought the first time, and I'm, I'm going to be so unoriginal and teenagerish. Now, I should probably say I want to meet some great hero in time, but I don't. I would love to meet Jacoby Shaddix, of Pop, the lead singer of Papa Roach. Just because that band is just my hero band, and I've, they've been my favorite band forever, and I can relate to their all their albums and their songs, and they get me through some of the toughest times, so and best times. But that's definitely who I want. I, I've actually touched him, but I have not formally met him. No homo, but I have. So thanks for the question. Question number two comes from Jesse Bop, 1996. Great name. Are there any causes you strongly believe in? Yes. I believe in a lot of causes, but strongly I support uh, anti-bullying. Uh, I can't stand that shit. My brother's had a problem with it. I never really had a big problem with it, but my brother has. Even recently, like, it kind of just... And I just hate it. Like, I don't know. I, I can't stand bullying. It, it, it really just pisses me off, you know. Any bullies want to mess with anybody, tell them to come mess with me, because I, I can't fucking stand that. can't stand that shit. So, I support that. You know, there's not much I can do about it, but... Yeah. Pink Ballerina, 19, uh, Pink Ballerina 95 asks, What is the craziest thing you've ever done in your whole life? zip lining in Mexico two years ago. I went on a trip this summer and last summer. And last summer I went zip lining in Puerto Vallarta and that was crazy. Uh, I'm, I'm, I have a fear of heights kind of ish and so me and my brother and my stepdad, I just call him dad, we went zip lining and it was crazy like you're way up over the forest and you're on this little zip line and it was um, it was nerve wracking but I did it and I don't know. It was something cool to check off on my bucket list. Tori Renee asks, if you were to put a face, picture, or picture of anything what uh, on a dartboard to stab, who or what would it be? Um, good question. I don't really have a person. Of, I probably, you know, I'm not into violence or anything like that, but, you know, somebody that really frustrates me would probably be, I, I can't stand Hitler, I couldn't, reading history and, and, and learning about that guy frustrates me so much, and, you know, I'm not gonna do that, because this is not my thing, but probably one guy I would love to see get revenge on is Hitler, because he was just cruel, he was cruel, he murdered thousands, hundreds of thousands of people, and, just in, in horrible ways. So, thank you for your question. <laughs> uh, Jade Welly, Welly Smith asks, how old are you? I picked this question because this is the per first person that said it. A bunch of other people asked it, but I picked the first person to say it because I'm tired of answering that damn question. I'm 17. My birthday is on May 26. It doesn't matter how old I am. I'm a teenager. I'm done, and no, I know you guys, it's not your fault, anybody that asked it or has asked it, but it gets so goddamn annoying. I already get a lot of questions of people talking to me on Twitter. Having to answer how old I am all the time just gets on my nerves. I just got a good idea. Maybe I should just put that in my damn description. I love Sky Roach. Touche on the name. My question is, do you have parents because I never see them? I know you guys don't see them, and the reason is, is because my parents don't know I make these videos. Uh, nobody in my personal life knows I make these videos. Nobody except for my brother. And I think, to, like, two of my best friends I've mentioned it to. Like, it's, I'm, 
I am Sky Roach is a character. He's me in my best, my crazy, swacky side of me. He's still me. He's nothing made up. But he, he he's a character. And I didn't want to get personal people watching it because I couldn't completely be myself if personal people that I knew were watching. I couldn't let go and just be crazy in the kind of character I envisioned for my YouTube channel. So they don't know. All the people that follow me on Twitter are people I don't know. And that's cool, you know, I, I like that. So I keep it a secret. That's my big secret. Skylar is my first name, but Roach is not. Roach is, I got from Papa Roach because that's my favorite band. Bonnie3749 asks, on a scale of one to a gabillion, how much do you love your fans? I love you. Thank you, uh, Bonnie, but I don't know. I don't wouldn't call people that follow me fans or people that subscribe to me fans because I'm not just an Bieber or anything like that. I just make fun videos and I don't know. I think at the most I call you guys followers or people that enjoy my content and stuff. I really am glad I got a lot of support over the last like two months that I started this and it's just it's just skyrocketed and it's more than I could ever ask for and I'm super super appreciative appreciative of all the support and everything and I'm gonna make more you know this is this is something I enjoy Destiny Kramer asks what influenced you to make your videos as far as YouTube sensations go Shane Dawson is a huge influence Sexy Phil is a huge influence uh, who else? Uh, JC Kalen, he's pretty cool. He makes some cool abstract videos. You know, equals three, all that stuff. Tosh.0, as far as regular TV goes, I like him and some of his uh, video uh, his show, Tosh.0. Also, uh, Jane Well makes some pretty, pretty interesting videos. He's pretty rad, um, as far as YouTube goes, too. So, yeah, those are a couple of them. But mostly, it's just me. It's just me out of my boredom. Being original and being me. You are so crazy asks. If you were a unicorn, what color would it you be and what special power would you have? I just picked this question because it was great and it was random and I love it. Let's see, I'd probably be black just because I wear all black clothes, mostly because of my band shirts and a lot of bands I like. The theme colors are black and black matches with anything. So I know it's very dark. Hopefully I won't be an evil unicorn. I think I would have the power. To, I'd want to have the power to go back in time because there's so many, not so many, but there's a, a lot of moments, and I haven't even lived that long yet. It's only 17 years, and there, there's those few moments that I really wish I could go back and live over and over again. Not forever, but there's certain places that made me happy, or things that I re regretted, or so to kind of make a funny. Uh, more serious spin on a funny question that's what it would be so yeah um and to uh, other shit to talk about uh I told you guys I was gonna film on the last camping trip I went on I forgot to bring the camera with me so yeah I didn't get to film it but it was a good thing anyways because I got sick the whole damn time and while all my family were out having a good time with family friends who also came along all brought camping trailers I was stuck in my camping trailer the whole time puking and not feeling well and it sucked really bad so yeah follow me at i am sky roach on twitter i'll put the links and shit below and uh thank you everybody for your questions you know maybe i'll do this again for 500 let's make it 500 subscribers and i will do another questionnaire because i think this is kind of fun so yeah i will see you guys another time